Well, hey there, friends. I am Deborah, and welcome to Eat Sleep Atlanta. Let me show you an amazing place to sleep, just an hour north of Atlanta. Come on in. This is Nature's Nook Treehouse. Not your average treehouse. I don't know about you, but um, I built a little treehouse when I was a girl. It didn't exactly look like this. Um, for starters, I'm noticing this amazing oak tree. Yes, we designed this oak tree because we wanted to help our guests feel connected to nature. And I love that it's right here, actually next to the queen bed, giving me that connecting to nature experience. And speaking of connecting with nature, we also chose the largest window that we could possibly find. And it was quite a feat uh, getting it up onto this balcony, about 400 pounds. But it's really helping our guests, I think, really take in this experience of the beautiful property that we sit on in Dahlonega, Georgia. Speaking of these beautiful trees, uh, there's a number of poplar trees that sit on this property. And so what we did is we had the guys take some poplar trees down. We cut them into slabs and then we had them curated and dried for over a year in our warehouse. And that is how we arrived at these stunning floors. These are poplar trees here on the floor carved with this live edge finish. I just love the way that it almost looks like a jigsaw puzzle. The way that they hand scribed these so that they just fit together just so in creating this really beautiful custom floor. You know, there's a couple other things I wanna point out to you here at the Treehouse. Uh, let's go outside. Let me highlight the Shisugi Bun exterior, which gives it this very sort of sleek, sophisticated look. Follow me. I don't know about you, but I love the exterior of this treehouse. This is a technique called shosugi ben, which is a Japanese technique. They took this cypress wood and the guys torched it. And what that fire does is it actually seals the wood from water, from bugs, and gives it, I think, what is a very sophisticated, sleek look to the treehouse. So I just love it. Uh, it's really signature for our Nature's Nook Treehouse. Now these chairs and this table, we've got more over here on the deck. These are actually handcrafted by our Treehouse Squad, made out of Kentucky whiskey barrels. And I think they provide the perfect setting for a glass of wine, don't you? Beautiful. You know, one of the reasons people love to come to Dahlonega is for the waterfalls, the wineries, and hiking. Uh, so we thought we would take full advantage of the property that we sit on, and we created actually a nature trail. We call it the Fern Forest, and it's just down the hill from the treehouse. And it's a beautiful trail right through the woods here, and the ferns are resplendent in the spring and summer, so it's a really peaceful place to, uh, you know, take a walk. One of the inspirations for the way we set up these beds was a train car in India. In India, the train cars have these twin beds that fold down from the walls. So I thought, why not have ultimate capacity? We put in these twin bunks and I just love them. I grew up in a family of seven. So sleeping in a twin bunk bed is only too much fun. In fact, I'm ready for a nap. I don't know about you, but I love to wake up to a good cup of coffee, which is why we always include a bag of our locally roasted solid ground coffee. We've got a nice little smeg coffee maker. We have all the essentials in our little tiny house here. We've got a nice little oven. We have a little refrigerator with a freezer. We've got the sink. We've got a teapot. We've got a French press. We've got wine glasses. We have bourbon glasses. We are ready to have a good time. Well, just because you're getting away doesn't mean you don't want to get a little bit of work done. We actually have amazing Wi-Fi here at the Treehouse. I love this cozy spot to just sit and relax, right? This is a queen-size bed. And the bedding is so luxurious. This is uh, made by Amity Bedding. It is 100% cotton. We've got some linen pillows back here. The view from here is I'm getting not only this huge window here, but I'm also getting these cozy little nook windows here. And right here is a little reading nook, okay? Amazing spot for books, for whatever. I mean, you could just like spend the entire afternoon right here. Just, you know, pour me some tea, a glass of wine, 
and I'm, I'm happy, right? Um, it's just the coziest little nook. We did actually a really fun name competition for the name of this treehouse. We got so many great submissions, but Nature's Nook won the competition, and I actually think it's perfect because talk about a nook where you're experiencing nature, it is cozy as can be. You know, one of the things we get asked a lot is, is there indoor plumbing in your treehouse? Do I look like the kind of woman who wants to use a porta potty? No, okay? Uh, these are luxury tree houses, and I just love this bathroom here in Nature's Nook. Let me highlight just a few things. I love this lighting. Give me good lighting. Uh, this sink, I love a beautiful vessel sink. I love ample storage for the things that I bring, but also the things that are here already, like extra toilet paper, and of course, a blow dryer, right? And here in the shower, I love this rainfall shower head. And one of the things I actually insisted on design-wise was this window. Um, I really wanted to be able to feel the wind and actually feel the outside, see the view while anybody was showering. I love it. I think it's a really, really pretty space. So how did you get into tree houses, you may ask? Uh, we had a few houses already up on Airbnb, but our lead craftsman was getting married and he was going on his honeymoon to the West Coast and he was gonna stay in some tree houses. So we thought, you know what? Uh, let's have him uh, do some reconnaissance while he's there and come back and let us know what you found out. So he came back and we were all fired up as a creative team. We have a really cool, interesting uh, future for this treehouse. We would love it to have a live roof, which means that we want to grow moss on the rooftop, which I think would be super cool. I personally would like a couple little goats up top, uh, you know, just munching on the grass a little bit. I think that would be a really cool thing. Cheers. <laughs> Conversation's always better around a fire pit, don't you think? Yes. And you know, nothing says vacation like s'mores. Um, we always include our little s'more kit, but I really love this solo stove. One of the reasons I love it is because it's like smokeless. Um, it has a way of keeping the smoke to a minimum, but still giving you all the warmth and all the cozy, right? So um, I think we should probably really test it out with uh, one of these s'mores that you think. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, thanks for joining me on this tour of Nature's Nook Treehouse in Dahlonega, Georgia. You know, a lot of people struggle with that word Dahlonega, like, does it rhyme with something? Dahlonega? Harmonica? Now that just might work. See you next time.